Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I figured that I would film a day in my life because Jacob's actually off work. Um, he's been off work for the last few days. And so I figured we'd just do a little day in our life. Um, first thing in the morning, I like to sit down. This is something new that I've been trying to get into. Um, I like to sit on the couch and read at least two chapters of whatever book I'm reading. My sweet, sweet, sweet sister-in-law um, gifted me this book and I've read, I guess, four chapters of it so far love it it is a great book i highly recommend it if you're looking for something to start reading um it's very motivational and um i don't know i just love it a lot so i'm gonna read two chapters of that and enjoy my coffee because i cannot get my morning started without some coffee and then after that i'm going to do a workout today i'm starting mari's um mari llewellyn i always talk about her guides i'm starting her second home guide um <coughs> Excuse me, and my hair looks crazy. Whatever, we've all accepted the fact that I do not really care how I look. <laughs> um, I do care how I look. Just, we're friends here. This is a, a, my special happy place that I don't feel like I get judged too much on how I look. Whatever. Let me get back to what I was talking about. So, I'm on her second home guide, and today is leg day, so I am going to be do that. I'm going to be do that. I am going to be doing that um, workout from her guide. And then uh, Jacob has to go and pick up some dry cleaning. He had to get his um, one of his uniforms dry cleaned for a little thing he has going on at work this week. And we have to go pick that up. He needs to get a haircut. And then we have to go to Walmart because Jacob and I recently decided over the weekend that we want to start building our, our home gym, which we have a good amount of stuff. We have a, an elliptical. We have about four or five sets of dumbbells and kettlebells. I'll actually give you all a little view of our garage right now. Um, we currently, not currently, why do I keep saying the wrong words? Ugh, that's frustrating. We recently added some new things to it, so I do wanna show you guys, and yesterday we went ahead and cleaned everything up. Um, please ignore the big box from our couches. We have been having a lot of trouble finding out who to call to do a bulk pickup. It's just annoying. And sorry if you hear that weird music. Jacob's been playing the Witcher game and he's obsessed with it, so. I just let him do whatever he wants to do as long as I can do what I need to do and he's not bothering me. So I'm going to go ahead and flip you all around so you guys can see what our garage looks like and then I'll let you guys know what the plan is for our garage. Alrighty y'all, so when you step out of the house over here to your right, we have this little cubby thing that has all of our water bottles. Before we moved into this house, we never had a refrigerator that had a water system thing. So we had, um, I don't even know what it's called whatever we had to get those jugs for water so we don't have to use that anymore so we just keep them over there to the corner then we have the elliptical <clears throat> excuse me and we have rocky's food right there and i love this container i got this off amazon but it, no bugs or anything can get through it and it stores all of his food and keeps it fresh i love that highly recommend that if you have a dog and so then you come over here and we just got this easy bar um this weekend it was fairly inexpensive for, i thought it would be a lot more expensive and then um when we first moved here so like about a month or two ago jacob got this power tower so that's really nice and then we recently got the battle ropes which i have been loving those things are awesome really hard get your heart rate up but i love it and then over here we have all of our dumbbells and kettlebells and his little ab roller thing and then we just have all our extra military storage stuff and tools and paints for the house. This is the box I was telling y'all about. Please ignore that. We got to figure out what to do with that. And then for now, we just have um, Jacob's SIF gear just sitting on a table. We have to go through that and put it in a tub for him. And then we have all the Christmas um, stuff. And then we mounted the Dyson and stuff just to make it look a lot nicer. This needs to get painted. The painters did not paint the garage. It's fine. <laughs> And then, uh, yeah, so this is the whole garage situation. I just have this chair hanging out for when Rocky wants to come out here and hang out. He has somewhere to sit, so just ignore that. But what we're thinking is, uh, we're thinking about mounting a TV. We have an extra TV in the house, so we're thinking about mounting it somewhere, probably right here. Um, that way we could stream on the Fire Stick our workouts, and we could just see them without having to bring our iPads and stuff out here. Um, I thought that would be nice, so we're considering putting it right there. If it doesn't go right there, maybe possibly over here, but I would really prefer for it to be right there. So we're going to Walmart today to go try to find out um, if that's gonna work right there, which I hope it does, because I think that'd be great. And then we have all this room. Originally, we weren't planning on making this a full garage gym. Um, we were gonna do half of this, like we had this um, power tower over here, like right next to the Dyson. 
but we decided that since we are going to be here for quite a while we would rather this be a full home gym so we are going to be adding to it hopefully um we're going to be adding a rogue pulley system so we could do tricep um like extensions or whatever and pull downs and stuff which would be super nice to have and um, over time we'll just accumulate a lot more stuff and we'll just bring it with us wherever we go and we have our own little gym which is very nice because who doesn't love working out at home you don't have to get ready to impress anybody <laughs> so yeah for now that is our little situation in the garage i love it i love this house i'm just really happy here i feel really good i feel very blessed and it's just a good feeling knowing like that you're just i don't know it's, it's a good feeling feeling this way. I don't know how to explain it any other way. I just am very happy and feel very blessed. Um, yeah, so um, I'm gonna go ahead and just finish my coffee, read a couple chapters in my book, and then I'm going to do my leg workout. And once I'm ready and we get ready to leave the house, I'll show y'all what we're gonna do. One eternity later. Okay guys, so it's been several hours later. It took a lot longer to do everything I needed to do. Um, and now we're just now getting ready to head out, but I want to show you guys my outfit. So this sweater my mom actually got on sale from Old Navy, but it, when it, it fit me, but it did not fit me how I wanted it to fit me. It was like too tight. So I never wore it and now it's too big. So I had to front tuck it, which I don't mind. I kind of tuck but like in the back. And then these are new jeans that I got from uh, American Eagle and I love them a lot. I think they're really cute, but I only, problem is I did not realize the back of them is like that so it's like missing half the pant legs so it looks kind of like I'm flooding from the back but I think it's cute Janae said it's cute bag is from Target of course Target has everything that you need it's super nice it has a lot of room in it I had to upgrade because I have a lot of crap <laughs> and then yeah I just did my straight hair normal makeup nothing crazy and I think we're going to go and get Jacob's dry cleaning first, and then we are going to head to Walmart, and I'm going to try to vlog in Walmart for the first time. Actually, I have tried. I never really say anything because it makes me uncomfortable, but I'm going to try for y'all. So, let's get this show on the road. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. How was your haircut? Do you like it? Yes. Yes. <laughs> your face your face looked like you were constipated. It was really funny. <laughs> yep guys, this is my husband. Doesn't have much to say. Ever. So we had to make a pit stop at Walgreens because I have not had a whole lot to eat today and we had to go out of the house because it was getting late and so I'm getting hangry and I'm trying to be nice but it's really hard so I'm going to look for a protein bar to eat because I'm starving. Okay guys so I couldn't find a protein bar that I wanted so I ended up getting turkey jerky and I'm going to eat this whole thing and the whole thing is about 230 calories so not bad. I also got a 90 calorie Colby Jack cheese stick and Jacob was kind enough to get me a sugar-free Red Bull. So I think now we're going to head to Walmart, do a little shopping. I'll show you guys um, what we end up getting when we get back to the house. And then uh, oh, we also have to pick up his dry cleaning. So I think we're going to do that first. But yeah, I'll see y'all when we get to Walmart. So we're looking at uh, space heaters right now for the garage because it is freaking cold in the mornings when you get up to work out. I also got myself some Equate um, protein bars just to have on hand just in case I ever do get hangry like that again. I could just throw in my purse and go. And then, uh, yeah, we also want to get the TV mount for the garage so we could hang up the TV. Hopefully today, fingers crossed, it works. Um, yeah, Walmart Adventures, guys. Walmart Adventures! <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, I don't know where else to put you, so ignore this angle, but um, I'm gonna do a little Amazon slash Walmart haul. So I showed you guys that I got these protein bars. If you haven't tried Built Bars, they're extremely good, and the inside is like, kind of like a Three Musketeers, like very, I guess, is it nougat -y? Nougat-y? I don't know. <laughs> but they, um, the Walmart brand Equate has like off-brand ones. So I got Caramel Nut. That just looks really good. They're Pretty low in calories actually. Five grams of protein, one total gram of sugar, five grams of fiber, and 130 calories for this bar. Then I also picked up the caramel chocolate peanut nougat, and this has 10 grams of protein, 
one gram of sugar, eight grams of fiber, and 160 calories. So not bad at all. And then we also picked up one of these three outlet, that's what it says, right? Yeah, surge protectors for the garage since we are mounting the TV. We went ahead and picked up the mount for it. So it's a little TV. I think it's like, what did we say? 32? 26. 26. That was really off. I don't know where I got that from. 26 inches. So it's a very small TV, but it's perfect for the garage and for working out. So pick that up. Um, I'm pretty sure I showed you guys in the house tour th that we have shades in the house and not actual blinds. And so in our bedroom, it gets kind of bright. I'm in the mornings and I have, um, what are they called? Like the darkening curtain things. But because the shades are like coming out of the uh, windowsill, like they're more th like out towards us than pushed in. I don't have enough room to put a tension rod. So I picked up a dollar, one of these, um, what the heck are they called? Curtain rods. Is this crooked? I feel like I'm kind of crooked. Whatever. Um, and then a broom because we um, are making it a point to sweep the garage out once a month to keep all the spiders away, except for the ones that are up top. Jacob's not letting me um, kick, kick them out of our, um, our house because apparently they catch mosquitoes and stuff. So we'll leave those there. But we needed to tell our broom because right now we're working with like a child sized one. So we got a normal size one for adults. And then from Amazon, I picked up one of these, um, Jesus, I don't know the name of anything. Like a wall plug in thing that has the USB things, just two of them, because Jacob doesn't have a charger for his phone on his side of the bed. He only has his lamp and his Apple Watch charger. So I got one of these so I could plug in his Apple Watch and his phone charger so he can actually charge his phone at night because he has this kitchen one and he charges it in the kitchen when he gets home from work. And then also we currently outside on our um, power rack on the Olympic bar have the squeezy little things to hold the weights on. And I don't like that because I feel like my grip is really weak and it hurts my hands. So I got pink. They only had pink for on Amazon that I could find that had really good reviews, but we just got these ones that you just slide on. So they're like a lot easier to open and you just slide them onto the bar and they hold your weights in place so they don't fall off. And then you just close them. So other than that, in the garage, we picked up just a big blue um, plastic bin for Jacob to put all of his um, gear in. And yeah, I think we're going to attempt to try and mount the TV. And then once we do that, I'm going to start dinner. So let's go ahead and do that. Hey y'all, so Jacob and I are going to attempt more Jacob than me. You good, Rocky? Okay, so we're going to try, hopefully, fingers crossed, to hang this TV up. Hopefully it works. Um, I'm really just here for some emotional support. Are you good? Y'all should see him staring at me right now. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'll just montage this. Well, since we're out here, I figured I might as well show y'all the tub we got for his gear. So yeah, just this bad boy right here. Not that one, I just walked into the screen. <laughs> <laughs> Jacob doesn't think I'm funny. It's okay. Okay guys, this is a wonderful day. This was just a TV I've had since I was younger and um, it was, I don't wanna say it's going to waste cause it was in the guest room, but no one, we don't have guests very often that watch TV. So um, we decided to put it in the garage because we feel like it will get more use. I can do YouTube workouts out here. I can um, airdrop, if you download this app on Fire Stick, you can like airdrop from your phone or iPad and so I can make my workouts bigger on, from Mari's guide. I'm just super excited. That was honestly a lot easier Pretty inexpensive. The mount was only like 20 bucks. It was kind of hard to understand, but I'm glad that Jacob was here to help me because if he wasn't here, I probably wouldn't have done it. But I'm happy 
that it's finally up. I'm so excited. And I've had this Velcro forever, but I'm going to put Velcro on the back of these remotes so we don't lose them. And I'm gonna Velcro them like probably underneath the TV. So if we ever need the remote, you just take it off and boom, they're there. So yeah, I'm gonna finish up uh, taking care of this TV, setting everything up, and then I'm going to get started on dinner because it's getting pretty late. It's already like 6.20. And then I'll show you all what we're eating for dinner. It's gonna be nothing crazy, but it's gonna be good. So I'll see y'all in a little bit. Okay, so for dinner, we decided to go with spaghetti. Jacob has normal spaghetti um, made with ground turkey. And then I have egg noodles mixed with zoodles and it's a little ground turkey spaghetti situation. So I'm super excited to eat this because I'm very hungry and it's getting late. Um, and I guess I'm just gonna enjoy this and then I'll see y'all after to end off the video. Alrighty y'all, so we finished dinner and cleaned up the kitchen. So I gotta go to sleep in a clean house. But to end off the night, I am going to have my dessert, which is usually, it varies, but tonight I'm having a chili cow, um, what is this, brownie batter ice cream, 190 calories for this little tub. And it's super good. Um, it actually has 12 grams of protein too, so that's cool. Um, yeah, and so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know today was kind of all over the place. I'm exhausted, but, and I have a weird alfalfa hair. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it anyways. Please go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you haven't. I would love to have you around. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I really hope you did. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.